Here we go! How's it going guys? This is Luis with the Gaming Block Network and today we're going to give you guys a little preview of Foosball 2012 for the PS3 and PlayStation Vita. You can currently pick this up on the PlayStation Network for $7.99 or if you're like me and you have a PlayStation Plus account, you can get it for $5.99 and save yourself some money. The first thing I want to tell you guys is to try out the tutorials. If you're going to download the demo or if you're going to buy the game, try out the tutorials because the controls are a little bit weird on the Vita. I haven't played the PS3 version. But the Vita version particularly, the controls are kind of weird and they are hard to get used to kind of. You need to use the touchscreen, the left analog stick, and the combination of different face buttons. After you get the controls all set up, I highly recommend you practice like one or two matches with the quick match. The opponent or computer is alright, he's not really that hard to beat. But it'll give you practice for playing multiplayer matches in the campaign mode. Multiplayer is probably the funnest part about this game because the opponents online are actually pretty good, at least the ones I've played. With that said, online mode is pretty much my favorite mode so far. It's really fun and it's just really fast paced. The campaign mode is sort of like that pyramid of difficulty. It starts off easy and it gets difficult as you work your way through the campaign. Just from my first impressions, I'm sort of liking the game. The controls do have a learning curve, but once you get them, the game becomes a lot more fun. If you want to try out the game before you buy it, there is a free demo on the PlayStation Network. It won't do too much damage on your Vita's memory card because it's only 134 megabytes so I highly recommend it try it out if you don't like it delete it if you like it purchase the game it's pretty cheap stay tuned for a full review towards the end of the week thank you guys very much for watching be sure to check out gamingblog.net for all your latest video game coverage and we'll see you guys in the next one